you've been tried And I believe you will do some time And I think it is safe to say You're finally gonna be locked away I believe you've been tried So the R. Kelly verdict came in on Monday, found guilty on all nine counts. He faces 10 years to life in prison at his sentencing, which will happen May 4th of 2022. So that's next year. I get confused. I mean, it's all still 2020 to me, but May 4th, 2022 will be the date for the sentencing in the R. Kelly case. Bill Cosby chimed in through his publicist. So Bill Cosby has gone from being just a bad guy to a bad guy who now roots for other bad guys. He says R. Kelly was railroaded. You may have seen the documentary. Uh, I don't know that he was railroaded, but it did make me think and research something that happened here involving R. Kelly 25 years ago. It's like, to me, first of all, it didn't seem like it was 25 years ago. It seemed like maybe 10 years ago, but back in the mid nineties, R. Kelly did a show was playing basketball with his entourage over at Red Laurel's. Somehow got in a fight with some guys from Lafayette, Acadiana area. One of them ended up with over 100 stitches on his face at the hands of one of R. Kelly's people, one of his bodyguards, one of his posse, whatever you want to say. So he ended up settling out of court with that. That was when Mike Carson was the district attorney. I, I had to go look this story back up because I'd kind of forgotten some of the details. But I remember... We would laugh that R. Kelly would never be able to play Louisiana again because we were waiting for him. Like, if his plane landed, they were going to get him because he had skipped town. So they did end up settling that suit. But that was 25 years ago. So, you know, Bill Cosby, you could say what you want. You Maybe you didn't watch the documentary. I don't know if they had that on your on your TV in your cell while you were still locked up. But, but R. Kelly... A preponderance of evidence would be maybe an understatement. So we'll find out how long R will be locked away coming up in May of next year. Today, only on Big 102.1.